what is up youtube welcome back to my channel i am the tech teacher and here we cover all things tech whether that be tutorials tips or walkthroughs so if any of that subscribes you go ahead and drop a like and a subscribe down below it really helps out the channel more than you understand now today we're going to be taking a look at how to install the unminable app onto your pc what this does is it allows um people with a decent gpu or even a cpu although those that it might be mitigated might not be worth it depending on your cpu but it allows those people to be able to mine different coins um different like um cryptocurrencies i mean so what i normally do or with the coin that i normally mine is dogecoin and in about the past i think i've been running this about two weeks now i've gotten around 90 dogecoin or something like that and of course as always i'm going to show you guys my actual results on the computer they'll be able to break it down into how much i made in the last 24 hours when my last payout was because they only pay out in increments of 30 doge i'm not sure how they pay out with the other cryptocurrencies because the only one that i'm mining personally is doge but without going too too far into it let's go ahead and take a look at the desktop so i can run you guys through how to set it up on your computer and then we could take a look at all of my personal um statistics as far as how much i've made and how long it took me to make this much so without any further ado let's go ahead and hop into it Alright guys, the first thing you're going to want to do is hop on over to Unminable's website and you're going to get a landing page that looks something like this. It's going to have most of the coins that you will be able to mine on the front page, but we're not too interested in that. We want to focus on the download tab that was up top. And once you get there, you will get a page that looks something like this. And you want to click on the green button because that includes the minor files that you're going to need. Whether you're using your CPU or your GPU, you're going to need the minor files that comes with this download. Now, I already have it installed, so I'm not going to do it again. But you guys are going to want to run through that install really quickly. And um, just as a quick side note, Windows has... Um, a really bad relationship with like miners and that type of software i'm not really ex exactly sure what it is but it's gonna try to flag it as a virus if it does guys please don't panic this is not a virus it's not gonna crash your computer is perfectly safe just go ahead and um the pop-up that's gonna show up on your screen is probably gonna be something like an um like explaining that this program isn't safe and the only option you're going to see at first is don't run just go ahead and click on more info and then you'll be able to run the program and nothing will happen like i said it's just something with how mining software is made windows always thinks that it's a virus or malware but it's perfectly safe to run on your computer um so once you've done all that you can meet me at the mineable application and i'll show you how to get things set up from there all right, guys, once you get the mineable application all downloaded, I saved mine to my desktop. I'm going to put it somewhere that you'll be able to find very easily. You want to go ahead and open that up. So double click on the desktop. Should it take just a couple seconds before it boots up. It's going to be a really small screen like this. Mine is in dark mode, which is this little button up here. So if yours looks like this, do not panic. It's still the same thing. And I would actually recommend switching it to dark mode just because it's easier on the monitor and on the power efficiency and all those cool things. So you're going to want to click on continue and then select your hardware that you're going to be using, whether it's a CPU or a GPU. I'm only going to show you guys how to set up GPUs because I have a pretty decent GPU in my machine. So that's what I use to mine. But if you don't have a decent GPU or no GPU at all with this crazy market, and you just rock it with a CPU, you can mine like, like that, but it will be significantly less coins that you're mining than if you had a decent GPU. So you can click on this button down here, it says update miner file location. And that shows you where it saved your Phoenix miner, which is the miner that they use for graphics card. And the exact same shows you where they saved the XRNG or XRN rig. XM rig, there we go, for the CPUs. So like I said, we're gonna be doing the GPU. And this also gives it pretty much the same warning that I gave you guys earlier as far as antivirus thinking that um, the miner is malware and flagging it. 
just go ahead and skip through that but you probably had to skip through that to even open up this program so just go ahead and click on next once you do that you can select from this drop down menu any cryptocurrency that they have available of course that you want to mine but we are interested in dogecoin you also need to have a crypto wallet now I have Atomic Wallet and I'm going to put a link down in the, in the description for that wallet. Super, super easy to set up. Just go to the website, sign up for the uh, for the account and they give you the wallet pretty much. It's extremely simple. And you want to go into that wallet and you want to pick the Dogecoin wallet. Get that address and just go ahead and copy and paste it right in this line. And once you do that, you can click on referral code now I have a referral code that I'm gonna drop in the description down below if you enter that referral code into this bar you will get 0.75% off of your um, fees which isn't a lot but it's something hey might as well take it right and once you have all that stuff in there you're gonna want to click on start now it's gonna take a hot second and then you're gonna get a screen that looks just like this down in the bottom left hand corner you're going to see your current mega hash rate, which is mine is zero because we just booted it up and your calculated mega hash rate, which is just an estimation for about how much the system thinks that your GPU can pull in optimal conditions right now, I think. <laughs> so it's saying that it's about 43, although I know that my GPU, when the screen is off, it pulls about 53. And when the screen is on and the wall, the wallpaper is moving like it is now, it's going to be around like 45 ish, something like that might be a little bit less as we're recording right now as well which is definitely affecting it 37 but that's perfectly fine so you're going to be able to see um your balance because like i said i've been doing this for a couple weeks to make sure it's actually you know lucrative you can actually mine some doge off this thing and um shows me how much i made in the past 24 hours 6.9 practically seven i've gotten two payouts totaling up to 60.3 doge my last payment was three days ago and my payouts are set for every 30 doge so based on what i know about this program i'll probably be getting another payout about halfway through tomorrow if i don't turn off the miner just let it run until then and um it's pretty much all there is to it guys you can also click on this stats button right up here and then it'll open up a window that um shows you just a little more in-depth statistics for your miner you can see exactly how much your payouts was and when they when they were paid out you can see some little um news things like they, just, they just added a couple of new coins to the miner let's see my referral code is right here my referral code that i'm going to put down in the, in the description for you guys it shows exactly what my miner is doing right now and um what it's done in the past like as far as this graph and whatnot so this is a decent way i think to uh, check on your stuff if you know your doge address or your uh, crypto address you could just search it in on your phone if you have your desktop running and just check on your stuff even if you're um not really not really close and you can also toggle the dark mode here and right here it says that i have a one percent fee if i'm not mistaken i think that it was a 0.75 percent that they take off for that referral code so you're taking off three-fourths of that fee just by using my referral code like i said it's not a, a bunch but in those terms it kind of is so um that's pretty much all there is to this guy super simple um tutorial explanation to just put a um a little bit of extra money in your pocket all right guys that's all i have for you today if you did learn anything new or just in general enjoyed the video go ahead and drop a like and a subscribe down below as mentioned before it helps out the channel a lot more than you guys can really understand and also if you have any ideas for any future videos go ahead and comment those down below we're extremely close to 100 subscribers and i'm super excited i want to do something to celebrate this with you guys so if you have any ideas go ahead and let me know so guys as always thank you and have a good day